a fantastic game that day. Here come the Magpies. Oh, the handball wasn't great, though, and Clarence to bring it out of defence, but the kick's a shocker, and straight down the throat of the skipper. They don't come much easier than this when it comes straight down your throat, and he pops it through for the first goal of the game. The Pies are on the board here at KG5. Oh, smothered off uh, Arnold's kick and tumbling oh, towards no. the goal. Oh. This could be disastrous. It's all seen over. Castle's uh, tried for the Daniel Wells yes. there. <laughs> A shallow throw, punched down yes. by Duffy, is picked up by Silver. He farms out for Chambers and he snares. A valuable goal for the Roos. They're on the board here at KG5. Off it goes. Cox wrapped up and now Bowden gets the handball away. And now here's James Webb right on the paint of 50. He strolls on in, has a good look at goal, and it is a ripper. Magpies get their third. Bit of trouble with his kicking so far, Holmes. A little untidy. That's good work from Cunliffe. Shakes off the would-be tackler. Silva back for Cunliffe. Working it down the wing now, the ruse. Kicks in ball. That's beautiful for Webberley, but it got a touch on it. Keeps it moving to Harper. He eyes goal, and he hits goal. Beautiful stuff from the Ruse. Arnold, not his best kick. Tumbling towards Gunther. O'Brien there first. Farms it out. And Neil now will race away. He's got Silver oh. over the back in acres. Silver takes the grab. Dropped during the week. He got the reprieve with a laid out. He needs to put him away, and that's what he does. A good goal for Silver. A good goal for the Ruse. Nice bounce. Gets underway in turn number two. Very nice. As Duffy gets the footy back straight inside 50. Can they? Parker got it, but no. Out the back was Webb. Bouncing footy. Easy goal. Magpie's off to a perfect start. He can't find his target with a handball. Sultan now feeds it out onto the wing. Looking in the daily direction. Holmes comes bravely towards it, but doesn't kill the ball. Jai Behrman picks it up. Looks forward and finds his target. Whoa. And it's a good hit inside 50. Out the back is Bowden. A very good grab. Jay Bowden. Jay Bowden usually so reliable in front of the sticks. And this is no different. Straight through the middle. They're away here, Glenorchy now. Pack forms. Now we take the mark. And now Bowden again to his skipper. Webb gets it off. And now another inside 50 for the Magpies. Rainbird, nice mark. I was able to hit up Mitch Rainbird. So Rainbird wanders in. Kick is okay. It's a goal. So very fast start here for the Magpies in term number two. So they hit out one by Duffy, but it falls for Webberley. He looks Great at kick. goal and he turns around as soon as he kicks it. Beautiful finish from the coach. He started this game well. Too many Glenorchy players there, though, on offer. Now they're out of danger, Glenorchy. Mark taken by Grant. Great Webb. Kick. Webb goes to Rainbird. Just fell short. Back to the skipper. Now Webb hugs the boundary, tries to find Daly. And now it's over the top. And now they're away here through Brennan. Oh, that's Ball a great sense kick. It was a great kick, and he spots up the superstar, Jay Bowden. Gets uh, an opportunity for his second for the quarter. In he comes, Jay Bowden does not miss these and kicks it successfully. O'Brien with a quick clearance, but doesn't go anywhere too far. Walker brings oh! it back in, and that's enormous! <laughs> that is enormous! Wow. Bowden with a huge fly. That was extraordinary. Danger, no, it's still inside 50, but Bowden... Does well. He's a silky smooth mover. We know that. But O'Brien wraps him up. And he's pinged for holding the footy. I reckon he got caught there, boys, uh, not using his uh, left side, left handball there, and came back inside. Well read by Jackson O'Brien. Bit going on here too now as they play on. Used to just 13 points. In it comes. And it's a good kick. So Clarence hit back again. They won't go away, the Roos, despite being challenged here by Glenorchy. You wouldn't mind being a Clarence supporter because they just... Oh. I'll reserve comment on that one. <laughs> Atten looks further ahead and finds Chambers, who's an eager beaver. Gets it moving. Long from Cox. Good kick. Great kick. Finds Silva over the top. He can use Neil. Leaves it hanging a little bit, but Neil takes the grab. But you saw then, just as able to run and carry and slice it through by foot. 
Very casual approach from Neil, but he made no mistake whatsoever. Straight through the middle. So he had a few options there, but it was a bit slow to start. He ends up Beautiful. finding one, though, and he finds the great man again, Jay Bowden. Jay Bowden. He's a star, we know it. And he makes no mistake. To Salter. Neil tracks it down. Oh, the siren beats him. An entertaining second term here at KG5. Some fireworks to finish off here. Oh, right on the fence. Look They're all this. coming over. This is what you see from this rivalry. We love it. They know. Oh, another jumping on top. This is good. I'm Fantastic. not sure the match review panel will agree. <laughs> Yeah, there's, a, there's a player there down is. They're not for moving either. Milwaukee. They got Let ironed you know out, I think. Shortly. Hallett gets the handball over the top. Seymour does well. Dodges and weaves. Cox is now with the footy right on the paint of 50. A cheeky little kick inside. Silver takes the mark. Plays on and breaks the goal drought here in the third quarter. And now here's a chance for the Roos. Again, they go inside 50. Nice mark taken. They play on. And now Webberley, right in the pocket, coach of the Roos. They put his team in front. He's done it. He's done it. The coach has put his team in front. The Roos up by a point. They will not go away here at KG5. Players out. Oh, it's been a terrific quarter for them. So Bailey out of the ruck, slaps on the boot. Is it goal? Yes, it is. That is magnificent from Bailey, who's had a really good quarter. This kick is to the pack. Over the back was Neil. It falls okay. Slapped on the boot. Oh. It's silver, I think, or it might be Castle. Bailey does, though. Taps it down only as far as well James done. Webb. But big tackle the ball. and holding Fantastic. the footy. Great work by the big man. I reckon it's the best game I've seen him play. It, it He's terrific. had a great Rocking afternoon. Inside 50. Dickinson's there. So is the running Joshy Arnold bouncing towards the boundary and he sees it over for a boundary throw in. So, gee, they've got some... Uh, he's been pinged. He's been pinged for deliberate. Snaps it round. He's kicking. It's good. It is all Clarence here at KG5. They're running away with this game. The lead 20 points. Certainly puts the game in Clarence's favour. There's no doubt about that. Here's Webster. He wheels around. Gets the kick off to Quinn. Quinn gets boot to ball. Looks at goal. goal. And could that be the spark the Magpies need? It's picked Ooh. up by Dickinson. He collides with Joseph. They emerge with it. A, f a great kick inside to Walker. But here he is, Mitch Walker. Former Tiger. Now Magpie. Good kick. Sends it through. That is crucial. Game on here in the last at KG5. Who kicked an important goal earlier. Broke the drought. Gets it inside. Oh, good mark. How was he on his own? How do you leave Braden Webb on his own? That's a very good question, Damien Gill, because we know what he can do. He's destructive. He's a good goal kicker. It would be a multiple goal kicker. This to reduce it has. to five points. Braden Webb goals. Captain's goal. So wind causing havoc here in the dying stages of the game. There it, is. there it is! The siren and a massive win for the Clarence Ruse.